Historically, black colleges and universities around the country are known for producing some of the best talent to come through the college ranks and on to the National Football League. What many may not know is the fact that those talented student athletes were coached by legendary coaches who not only changed their lives, but helped change the landscape of college football. The Mid-Eastern Athletic Conference is proud to document and showcase some of these football coaching legends, including today's feature on a man who was known for his passion for achieving the great American dream. He did just that at Grambling State University, where he became a college football Hall of Famer and the winner of more games than any other coach in the known world. His name is Eddie Robinson. Quite a few kids come to you, they want to play professional football, and if you aren't careful, they want to remain eligible to do that. And, uh, and you have to think about what happens if he's not able to play because only a select few mm -hmm. uh, players are able to come out of college and go into professional football. So you have to talk to them about carrying on the academic, uh, the academics along with the, with the athletics. And this is what we've done through the years and this is what we'll continue to do. When I had a chance to, to, to go to Grandma, um, never really talked to Coach. Coach talked to my, my mom, and my mom woke me up and said, um, you're going to Grambling. And um, at that particular time, I'm wondering how my mom, or who called my mom and told him where I was going, and she said, Coach Robinson. And having watched Grambling football on television during that time, every Sunday morning, and uh, I thought that was something out the, the wild to be going to Grambling and play for Eddie Robinson. He was, he was legendary before I went there. The thing that separated Coach Robinson from maybe all other coaches is that he coached every position. And wherever his folk, wherever he was, was mainly the major part of the, the game plan. We didn't make a lot of mistakes because he believed in repetition, run it again. Most teams in the league he coached so long, and we had players who would leave Grambling and go to other schools. A lot of teams we found out knew our plays. And he believed if you keep practicing over and over again, the best team was going to win. There were so many, I guess, unique experiences that I had when, when working uh, with Coach Robinson. He showed me that, that you should never allow your opponent to outwork you, to outprepare you. At the same time, I looked at the relationship that he had with his family and with his wife, Doris, and that was an example that I saw that I would follow with my wife and, and my family. I want to be an American football coach. Whatever contributions that uh, uh, Warner, Stagg, or Coach Bryant made, I want mine to stand out equal to those. I just want to stand for whatever is good in our society. Now, whatever that is, that's what Eddie Robinson wants to be. 